So these are the three coils I've made so far. They don't look as nice as they could have done because I ended up having to put tape on them, but they're very tight, which is what I wanted. They're very compact. At no time has the uh, strain, for want of a better word, been ta tension, sorry, been taken off the wires. So that was the main thing what, that I wanted. I wanted all the holes the same size, pretty much central. And yeah, I'm just going to give you a quick preview of the, uh, how the coil winder ended up. We'll start from this end. Uh, it's, it's basically on an M10 threaded bar. This is just kind of works as a stop. Uh, runs up against this, which obviously moves. This moves the coil, fits in there, which is all aluminium. Uh, you can see... <coughs> Sorry, the light's not the best, but it's got a bit. It's got a good bevel on it, uh, which makes it a lot easier to take the coil out. That's that nut and that nut are squeezed very tight. Those two nuts are squeezed tight, and those two. And we've got the same. Oh, sorry. I'll carry on. And we've got the same on this end at the top, and we have our lovely Bosch cordless drill which uh, one speed is fine one speed is perfectly good enough uh, I ended up cranking the tension right up because what I've done I've got the wire very tense uh, I've just set up a sort of similar locking system here with the two nuts top and bottom uh, the two wires meet in there and then they come down through that block and underneath this roller thing in through the uh, in, into there and then get it this way I don't know why I've always made coils that way hang on let me just tighten it up tighten the drill up and then yeah so you would run at this kind of speed really And it's good <clears throat> works very well I'll just put it on uh, full speed for a second so you can see how ridiculous this drill is so yeah won't be running it at psycho mega speed so yeah that's it that's the coil winder and that's the progress so far just again these are 14 awg wire with 36 turns of two strands first coils i've made out of two strands so peace onwards and upwards it'll take me a few more days to get it done and then i'll make a video of uh, me building the actual beast piece this is what it kind of looks like disassembled so you've got that bit in the middle which just has one big hole in the middle for the uh, M10 threaded bar to go through. I found it very good to cover the insides with plastic. Then if you use super glue or resin, which is the plan, the plan is not having to mess about with cable ties or tape right at the critical moment and just uh, put some resin in or put some super glue in as you go along and basically then you won't have to do that but yeah this is <coughs> excuse me the sort of exploded view of the actual thing and that sits on here these just uh two slots basically and the drill goes here drives that and there's the lovely wire so yep yeah, look for more progress in the coming days peace out and here's a mention two for chris Closer to the truth and uh, Eric Jackson. Keep on rocking in the free world. Aye.